Hey guys, so today I have a PSA send off video for you guys. Um, I think I sent off an order, um, I think it was second week of June. Um, it was the normal bulk hundred card order and lucky for me, uh, one of the orders um, got done uh, last week. Um, it only took uh, 11 days. Um, some it's um, made me send off another PSA uh, bulk order off um, a bit sooner than I wanted to but um, I've got about 200 cards that I was meaning to send off I'm just waiting on a University Magikarp from Japan because I, I need a quick card to send off with it because when you send off a bulk order it's good to send off a, a quick order with it that way the package gets uh, processed a bit quicker whereas if you just send a bulk one it might might sit there for a week or two I've had that happen in the past but with the bulk um, uh, send off with a quick order it, it's usually three to four working days um, and they're in the system straight away so that's the uh, positive of sending a quick order um, alongside a bulk order so I've got two orders and um, I don't usually like sending off uh, one large order so what I do um, as close as I can get to 100 um, in this case one of the orders will be roughly 102 cards and one will be 104 I think I might have added and taken some cards out, so I've probably got to recount them but uh, let's get started um, I'm expecting a lot of stuff from Japan so I'll be sending off a, another bulk order at the end of the month. Um, my friend Trin is um, planning on sending 100 cards as well. So I'm going to be doing a bulk order with him around the end of the month. And touch wood, I should get my 337 cards back from, P um, back from Head because uh, he uh, took the cards for me. So I'm just waiting on him because he's a bit busy at the moment. Uh, but yeah, uh, let's get started. Uh, let me just tilt this a bit. So this is the 104 card order. Put that there. I'll just take a smaller bunch. So first off, we have a far-fetched uh, first edition. I did open two packs and uh, some of the cards got gem intense um, in my order that's coming back from PSA so I thought might as well send off the commons on commons it'll only cost me what seven bucks to grade them so uh, why not send these off as well so we've got far-fetched maintenance drowsy another drowsy Volpix um, double colorless energy, Porygon, Potion, Poliwag, Rattata. Uh, so that's the English first edition base cards. So next up we have a Latias first edition um, Delta species from Holon Research Tower, and a second copy. We've got. Uh, I think we've got three or four. We've got three Vaporeons, all first edition from Holon Research Tower. I got these in that bulk um, bulk lot I purchased. Uh, I think I'm, uh, a few videos ago I showed in a BCBM. Uh, we've got two Jolteons. Uh, we've got two Flareons. Um, I'm sending off uh, just some hollows as well, a bunch of hollows because I bought that massive hollow lot as well. So I've got three agrons from, I think it's uh, Mirage Forest or something like that. Uh, we've got Altaria EX as well. Pick up another lot. So we've got Amaldo EX. Another Moldo EX. I think we've got two Mews. 
Definitely hoping for majority 10s to be honest with all the PCG stuff. They are pack fresh. Uh, we've got a Walrein EX here. Two Arc9 EXs. And two gold, um, on two Golden Sky Silvery Ocean we've got Blissey EX. First edition. Um, Lugia EX. Ho-Ho EX. And Steelix, got two of those. Got a Sizzle EX. Politoed. We've got one, two, three Jolteons. Got quite a few of these coming back as it is, but you can never have too many Eve Illusion cards. We've got four Vaporeons. Two, yep, yeah. uh, just check here. Yeah. Two Flareons, um, two Typhlosion. I've got a couple of Alligators already sent off, so I thought might as well send um, two of the other Evolutions. So we've got two uh, Typhlosions, two Meganiums. On to Team Rocket Returns, we've got two Dark Amphros EXs. Uh, not EX, just normal hollows. Um, two hand dooms. Two togetics. Two dark celebes. Uh, three dark tyranitars. Hitmonchan EX. Two sizzle EXs. I think two cider, I think I'll call it a sizzle. Got two sizzles here. Uh, we've got Snorlax, Mewtwo, Sneasel, Himonchan. Um, those were the extra EXs I got. Now, this I actually bought a complete set as well. So, this is the complete set together so I've got Hitmonchan, Scyther, Sizzle, Snorlax, Zapdos, Mewtwo, Sneasel, Entei and a Suicune and I've also got two um, gold stars which I purchased from Japan we've got Celebi first edition and a Alakazam I think I paid about 2,000 yen each for them and they were mint so definitely not complaining with that um, next up we've got Fire Red Leaf Green uh, the complete set I purchased I've already got a complete PSA 10 set of these EXs so um, these will be for sale as a set um, so I've got Colour Fable Mr. Mine um, the Leaf Green version and then the Fire Red version um, Gerdos, Moltres, Articuno, Zapdos, Gengar, Electrode, and then I've got another spare, Mr. Mime, <coughs> Clefable, and Electrode. Cloister, I love the artwork, so this one is for me. I uh, want a PSA 10 copy in my collection. And then to finish it off, I think I've just got some VS cards. Uh, so we've got from the fifth movie deck. Um thing with these is I purchased a lot for, I think, $600 uh, from Japan. I think it cost me about 60,000 yen. And most of the stuff that I was hoping for was in rubbish condition. So whatever I could salvage basically um, I'm sending off for grading and these were part of it the rest of the cards are in that other PSA um, order so I'll show that off in a little while so we've got Pidgeotto, Aerodactyl, uh, Kabutops, Zatu, Espeon, Welma, Corsla, Politoed, Crobat 
and a reardose. I think I've got the trainers as well. So, um, I might just end up sending those off as well. Um, so I've got the complete set going off to PSA. Uh, let me just grab the bag. Put these back. So yeah. Um, um, what is it now? First July. So these will probably come back end of August um, if I'm lucky. Um, but PSA are pretty busy at the moment. Um, they've got their biggest show coming up in July. So, um, so I did talk to some uh, someone from PSA, <coughs> and he did mention um, there might be some delays. Um, due to um, the not being enough staff etc so if you are sending off um, any orders just keep that in mind so this is the second bulk order I think uh, these are all the cards that are salvaged from that $600 lot so first off we've got a electrode just a normal um, base one not a no rarity anything like that got Mewtwo Zapdos <coughs> Aerodactyl from Fossil Moltres from Fossil Gengar then we've got Jungle Wigglytuff um, Jolteon Nidoqueen got two of those uh, Venomoth, uh, Dark Alakazam from Team Rocket, uh, just Team Rocket, I think, Rocky Gang, um, Dark uh, Dragonite, uh, Giovanni's Persian, uh, Giovanni's Machamp, Sabrina's Alakazam, Slowbro, got two of those from Neo One, got Steelix, Skarmory. We've got Neo 2, we've got Sizzle, two Umbreons, um, a Blissey from Neo 3, and then we've got a Flying Pikachu, I think it's just for normal Coral Coral version. Um, it's just basically all the mint cards I could um, send off basically, just to make, make the money back. So we've got a GB Dragonite, we've got two of those, a Arcanine, they, uh, I'm not sure what version this would be, and um, they did do two versions of it, so I don't think there's any differences, um, like a glossy, non-glossy, it's just the same. Uh, we've got a Blaine's um, Growlithe Coral Coral. Uh, a Togepi, uh, Koga's um, Trick Room or something like that, some Coral Coral uh, promo, uh, got Sloking, um, got a Porygon, um, this was the main card uh, that I found, this wasn't even shown in the listing when I purchased it. But it's definitely mint, so hoping for a good grade on this one. With this, uh, there is a bit of hollow bleed. Uh, don't think it'll show on camera because of the lighting. Uh, but it's definitely mint, so hoping for a 9 or a 10. Either way, as this will cover probably half the cost of that lot. We've got a Articuno, uh, just the old back one, uh, Dragonite, uh, Mewtwo from Vending Series, This, if this gets a 10 it will be for my collection, if not I'll just auction it off. I think I've already sent one, you got a PSA 9. We've got the Quick Starter Dex Hollow, so we've got Scyther, Articuno, Zapdos, Moltres, um, some Charizard, uh, I'm not sure if it's the CD promos or whatever 
they're called I've never actually sent them in um, this one is a GB version and this one I think a CD version not sure um, probably have to look into it got two Blastoise um, I've recently purchased um, card savers I think the guy was in Venezuela or something but his card savers they stick together um, usually from American sellers the card savers don't stick I'm not sure if it's uh, bad stock or what but the card savers keep on sticking together uh, we've got GB Dark Ivy Saw um, a Steelix promo hollow um, actually got the complete T, uh, T promo set as well so that was something um, that I was happy to get in that $600 lot so I've got the Slowbro Evolution line um, the Johto um, first Evolution line got Bayleaf Quilava and Crocknell. Got the Legendary Birds, um, Articuno, Zapdos, and Moltres. And then we've got Ivysaur, Charmeleon, and Wurtwurtle. Got the Dragonair, uh, Dragon, Dragonair, Dragonite. Dratini, <laughs> Dratini, Dragnair, and Dragonite. Yeah, um, Flareon, Vaporeon, and Jolteon. Imakuni's Wisma, uh, Loud Red, and Exploud. And then we've got Lavatar, Pupitar, and Tyranitar. Uh, the VS Sizzle Primer, Rocket Sizzle. Um, some Celebi promo. I think it's the P promo. Uh, next up, we've got E Series One Blissey, Polyrath, Rapidash, Blastoise, Suicune, Nido King, Crystal. Um, I think with these hollows, that was whatever I got in that $600 lot and the rest of these cards are which are purchased separately so we've got Nidokin Crystal this was from the seller I got the two sets from the 5 Red Leaf Green and Team Rocket Returns and these were f the next few cards are from the Japanese store so we've got two DP T Charizards uh, the original reprints We've got first edition and unlimited uh, we have a dp3 charizard first edition i think i've got a psa 10 copy coming back and um, the base set min charizard I've got gemmin 10 another one coming back from psa I've got two of the art book and um, charizard full art And to finish it off, it's just these card savers are still sticking together. We have a wild, Bla um, what's it called? Wild Blaze, um, Charizard EX Full Art, um, Dragon Blade. Um, I think it was Dragon Blade where these both came from. Um, Mew Full Art and a Rayquaza. Got a another Golden Sky Silvery Ocean EX set. So we've got first edition Umbreon and a unlimited Espeon. Um Hold on Research Tower Umbreon. Um, e Series 2, I think it's Town with No Map, Umbreon Hollow. Um, Team Magma versus Aqua Umbreon and then we've got two Espeons stuck together again there we go we have a Dragon Frontiers Dragonite 
probably get a PSA 8 or a 9 with the Sentry. Got Altaria, same again, probably a PSA 8. Um, this one I was super happy about as the Sentry is bang on for a first edition copy, so if it gets a 10, um, I'll be pretty happy. And to finish it off, we've got some World Championship uh, promo, Lugia and Hoto. So yeah guys, um, that's the second bulk order I'll be sending off. Uh, like I said, um, I'll probably be getting my PSA returns this week. And probably in two, um, probably second, third week of July, I'll probably do another PSA send off with my friend Trey. Um, so yeah guys, um, touch wood, I'll see you next week in a PSA returns video. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed this one and I'll see you there. Thanks for watching.